Hello, this is a tutorial about how to add citations to a Microsoft Word document with Zotero. The tutorial will cover installing the Microsoft Word plugin for Zotero, creating in-text citations in Word, and creating a reference list in Word that will automatically update as you add citations to your document. To start, if you haven't already, you're going to need to install the Microsoft Word plugin for Zotero. Once you have the plugin, you'll have a Zotero tab on your Microsoft Word toolbar. The example at the top shows you what that will look like. If you haven't already done it, open Zotero, click on Edit, Preferences, Cite, and then go to the Word Processors tab, and then click on Install Microsoft Word Add-in. You might have to restart or open Microsoft Word. This can be a little confusing, so if you need to troubleshoot, go to zotero.org support slash word underscore processor underscore plugin underscore troubleshooting. Now that we have our Zotero tab in Microsoft Word, we can get started. Make sure you have Zotero and Microsoft Word open. Go to the document and click in the document where you want your first citation to appear. You can see here I've put it after the quotation. So with your cursor in the correct location where you want the citation to go, go up to the Zotero tab on the toolbar and click Add Edit Citation. The first time you cite in any Word document, Zotero is going to ask you which citation style you want to use. You can choose from this citation style li list. I've chosen APA style. You choose what you want and then click OK. Now, a red Zotero quick format band will appear in the Word document. If it doesn't and you get this Add Edit Citation box, that's the classic Add Citation view. If you prefer to use the quick format band, go back to Zotero, click again into Edit, Preferences, Cite, and the Word Processors tab, and you can unclick the Use Classic Add Citation dialog box. That will give you the quick format band the next time you go into Microsoft Word. So now, in the quick format band, start typing the name of the author or the title that you want to cite from your Zotero library. I've started typing little in the quick format band in this example. Zotero will suggest documents from your Zotero library. Click on the item that you want to add that citation. Now, the quick format band will still be there. It will show you the in-text citation as it's going to be entered into the Word document. You can see the field where the arrow is pointing where the citation will go. If you want to adjust the citation, you can double click on the quick format band now to make some changes. Let's do that. For example, when you double click onto the citation you've chosen, you can add page numbers for direct quotes, or you can suppress the author box if you want to exclude the author's names from the in-text citation. You can also use the prefix and suffix to add information at the beginning and the end of the citation. When you're ready, hit enter on the keyboard while you're in the quick format band, and you will see your in-text citation in APA style. You can see the arrows pointing at it here in the document. Good job. Now let's say we want to add a references list or a bibliography at the end of the document that reflects all the citations we've used in the document. Again, we're going to go to the place in the document that we want this information to go. So I'm going to put my cursor where I want it to go. I've created a new page, I've added a, the title references, and now I have my cursor clicked down where arrow number one is pointing. Then I go to the Zotero tab and I click this time on Add Edit Bibliography. Any items that I've cited in the text is go are going to appear in a list in the citation style that I've chosen. This list automatically updates, as I mentioned, as you add more citations to your text. If you need more information about Zotero, go to the Zotero website at zotero.org and click on the document documentation tab. There's lots of helpful information there. Thanks for watching this video. Here's a little information about it. 